Scientists across the centuries have always been obsessed with the mystery of the universe. Do we truly have neighbors among the various planets scattered in space? Since 2016, astronomers have discovered that our neighboring solar system is none other than the Alpha Centauri. Alpha Centauri consists of two large stars, namely Alpha Centauri A and B. And this solar system hosts an exoplanet that scientists have dubbed the Proxima B, given its location to the habitable zone of the red dwarf star Proxima Centauri. At only four light years away, Proxima Centauri B is the closest known exoplanet neighbor to the Earth. Scientists believe that this planet might be to some certain extent habitable to us. However, something weird seems to be going on in the planet. What exactly is going on? Does this have adverse effects on our planet? Watch this video as we discuss scientists' shocking discovery on Proxima B. Welcome to Posh Future, where we discuss the latest trends in science and technology. Do well to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell to our channel to stay updated. Since 2016, scientists have discovered what is assumed to be a new planet, the nearest one to be ever found outside our solar system. This small and rocky planet orbiting the Sun's closest stellar neighbor seems to share some certain features with our planet. Scientists discovered a massive and increasing number of exoplanets, almost the shape of the Earth, orbiting distant stars. Between 1995 and 2015, National Aeronautic and Space Administration NASA, discovered about 2,000 out of the 3,600 exoplanets loitering the universe today. Some of these planets were found in the habitable zones of their stars with a favorable temperature that allows for the presence of liquid water on the surface. However, what truly caught the attention of scientists about Proxima b was the position of its solar orbit about 1.42 light years closer star to our Sun. The existence of the Proxima b was first discovered by Guillaume Anglada Escude and his team made up of 31 scientists. The nature of Proxima b poses an important question regarding the possibility of life on the surface of the exoplanet. With the use of the high velocity searcher on the ESO 3.6 meter, scientists follow the radial velocity method to determine if life truly exists on the planet. This method investigates the spectra of stars to check for signs of wobble, a terminology scientists use to describe the closer and further movement of the star from the Earth. The wobble is caused by the gravitational interference of planets that orbit the star. Given that the mass of the Proxima b does not surpass the 12% mass of our Sun with a 0.1% brightness level, it can be agreed upon that the Proxima b is about 25 times closer to our Sun. Exoplanets like the Proxima Centauri are renowned for releasing flares that question the existence of life on the red dwarf planets. The question of whether these exoplanets could house life or not has been a debate that has left the scientific community divided. Given that Proxima b is located in the habitable zone of the stars, some scientists believe that there might be a presence of aliens on the exoplanet while other scientists negate the existence of alien life. Sometime in 2020, Breakthrough Listen Scientist, a privately funded effort to search for signals from intelligent beings, recorded a signal while monitoring the Proxima Centauri for flares to understand how they affect conditions on the star's planets. Scientists debated if the signal frequency of about 982 MHz could denote the existence of extraterrestrial beings. However, since then, there have been no further claims amidst the community to support these findings. Another angle raised by these scientists is that the Proxima Centauri receives almost the same energy as the Earth does. To them, this may connote that liquid oceans could exist at their surface temperature, probably as large as the ones on Earth. Surely, the presence of water could possibly mean life. Mind you, the probability of Proxima b housing life or not largely depends on whether an atmosphere exists or not. Although Proxima b is a habitable zone of its star, its location to the sun hampers the existence of life. Planets must be 10 times closer to their star to be in the habitable zone, else they are more prone to damage from solar storms and flares. For us on Earth, our atmosphere absorbs these solar x-rays that make the planet safer for its inhabitants. However, for Proxima b, the stars of the red dwarf emit a great x-ray constantly, 4,000 times the intensity of our sun, and this may prove to be highly dangerous to life beings dwelling on it. 
Besides, there are no scientific backings on aliens making use of oxygen as earthlings do, or absolutely need water for survival. Now, it is a known fact that Proxima b is a tidally locked planet on which the part of it facing light has a region that reaches boiling temperature and produces constant hurricanes. It would seem there might be a small part where life may exist if it is possible. Given that Proxima b is close to its star, oxygen and nitrogen might escape from its atmosphere, leaving the exoplanets bare of life-supporting gases. A worst-case scenario is presented when hydrogen comes into the mix and all liquid water evaporates and sips into the atmosphere. Even if there is a slim chance of human existence on the exoplanet, scientists have revealed that it will take roughly 3,600 years to get there with existing technology on the ground. In other words, humans cannot possibly relocate to the Alpha Centauri simply because we might actually not survive the journey. While it is not clear if humans or aliens exist on this exoplanet, astronomers recently revealed a new space telescope mission, dubbed Ptolemon, to explore the stellar system further, as well as answer the mind-boggling questions about the planet. Christopher Lovey, man in charge of Espresso Scientific Performance and Data Processing, and other scientists who partnered to study Proxima b, believe that answers to whether the exoplanet should be revealed in the nearest future as advancements are constantly done on instruments employed. The forthcoming Ristretto spectrometer is being designed specifically to zero in on Proxima b and detect the light it gives off while the high-resolution spectrograph is another approaching super high-res instrument that should be able to detect faint objects in space as well as determine what their atmospheres consist of. Till then, we better keep our hands crossed and watch how the events unfold. Let us know what you think about scientists' shocking discovery of Proxima B in the comment section below.